This is your Skywatch 13 weather forecast with Drew Schweitzer. Welcome back to 13 News this morning on this Wednesday morning. Once again today we have some more rain showers and thunderstorms that have been moving through the area. Uh, unlike Monday morning, the rainfall totals aren't that impressive, but most places have picked up pretty close to a quarter of an inch. We saw 0.21 officially in Salina this morning, 0.28 for Concordia. Not too much in Manhattan, less than a tenth of an inch, and uh, just a little more than a trace in Hiawatha. Topeka checking in with 0.13 inches this morning, and uh, just about a quarter of an inch of rain in the rain gauge for Emporia this morning. Now, it looks like we're going to see dry conditions through a majority of the morning and then into some of the afternoon hours as well before we will see additional thunderstorms developing late this afternoon and this evening and also overnight tonight. So I would expect to add on to these rainfall totals over the course of the next 24 hours. But then after that, it looks like we'll see some dry conditions and then it's going to be dry for several days to come. It looks like this weekend is going to be absolutely fantastic. Temperatures as we kick off this Wednesday morning, 70 in Topeka. 70 in Hiawatha, everyone else starting off in the mid to upper 60s. It is 65 in Concordia, and right now we have 68 degrees in Manhattan. Winds are currently out of the south, up to 20 miles per hour actually in Topeka. Uh, it will be a little breezy today. We could see a south wind gusting to 15 or 20 miles per hour like we have out there right now. Today those winds are going to be out of the south because we're still on the front side of a cold front that will be moving through overnight tonight, but by this time tomorrow morning we will be looking at winds out of the north and north west on the back side of that cold front and then that will bring us some very nice conditions not only to end the work week but uh, the nice weather will continue into the weekend as well. Some rain showers and thunderstorms have been moving through this morning. They continue to press off towards the Kansas City area. We will see dry conditions through a good portion of the morning hours but then as a cold front swings in from the north and west this will bring us some additional thunderstorm development this afternoon, this evening, and overnight tonight. Some of those storms could be on the strong to severe side, so we'll have to watch them closely. The main threats would be some large hail and some damaging winds, along with some very heavy rainfall. But there is a, a slight possibility that we could see an isolated tornado or two. Of course, we'll be watching the situation closely here at WIBW, and if we do see any severe weather, we'll keep you safe and informed. That cold front swings through tonight. will be gone by tomorrow. Maybe a brief rain shower early in the day on Thursday. Otherwise, Thursday going to be a very nice day, and then that nice weather continues throughout the entire weekend. 84 for your high temperature today. We've had some rain showers and thunderstorms early this morning. A break through the middle of the day with some sunshine, and then more storms later on this afternoon. Overnight tonight, low of 64. Storms will be likely. Like I said, some of them could be strong to severe. A good night to keep those weather radios on. Tomorrow, look for a high of 80 degrees, some lingering showers in the morning, but we will be dry by tomorrow afternoon. Once we are dry on Thursday, we're going to stay dry for the next several days. Look at this weather. On Friday, a low of 59, a high of 81 with lots of sunshine, 58 to 85 on Saturday, and then Sunday, more of the same nice weather with a high of 87. We will warm into the lower 90s by early next work week, and then it looks like uh, after tomorrow morning, our next chance of rain won't move around until next Tuesday or Wednesday, guys.